Good morning. Welcome to day two of our trip to Pictured Rock National Lakeshore. Uh, today we are at Beaver Lake. Going to do the Beaver Lake Loop and then also check out Miners Falls and the Miners Overlook. Uh, last night was a wild ride. By the time we got to our campground, it was a, just a torrential downpour. <laughs> so we tried to set up camp and we just got completely rained out. So we wound up bailing out to a uh, hotel and uh, drying off and staying warm there. So, anywho, uh, I'm a little concerned lately. The past two days I've been waking up pretty sick to my stomach. So we're hoping that that doesn't uh, impede our trip. But hey, we're still bound and determined to have a great time. So, anywho, we will see you down the trail. For our second day at Pictured Rock, we visited the Beaver Basin Wilderness. The wilderness spans nearly 12,000 acres of protected wetlands and is home to several beautiful lakes, including Beaver Lake and Trappers Lake. I'm the Maple King. MapleKing.com. Early? This morning's hike is a 10 mile loop circling Beaver Lake, meandering through beautiful wetlands, and passing by multiple lakes before returning along 12 mile beach in the North Country Trail. This area is a backpacker's dream. The natural beauty, lakeside campsites, and the quiet solitude are just some of the highlights of the Beaver Basin Wilderness. We ran into several backpackers today, and I definitely plan on returning here for a trip in the future. Twelve miles beach was vast and reached as far as we could see. Not a soul was around and it made for a peaceful walk. Sitting down for lunch and watching the waves crash on the beach helped ease my worries about waking up ill each morning. Over the past few days, we hiked several sections of the North Country Trail. Samuel and I both talked about how much fun it would be to section hike the UP section of the over 4,000 mile trail. You'll never know what you run into on the trail. This cute little puppy's name is Betty. Uh, we tried to call her family and couldn't get an answer, but eventually they did find her and uh, we were happy to hear that she made it home. All of a sudden I feel like I'm back on the Sheltoe.
What the heck? Welcome to my lair. <laughs> the Maple King. Beaver Lake Loop was absolutely beautiful. It was just astounding. <laughs> anyway, we're just about done. Now it's on to Miner's Castle Overlook and hopefully Miner's Fall Falls. Uh, <laughs> if you can't tell, it's getting kind of ominous in the background. So we're hoping to at least get all this in before the storms hit again. I don't know if you can see that or not, but it's hailing on us. What the heck, Michigan? What is this place? <laughs> hail? Really? <laughs> I hope we're not in hail. And just like the summer storms back in Kentucky, the clouds parted and we were greeted with beautiful blue skies again. Miner's Castle Overlook was a beautiful sight. These rock cliffs were nicknamed by miners looking for minerals back in the late 1700s. From here you could see Grand Island, a destination that is surely on my list for a future return. Next episode on Ice Road Truckers. As clouds began to roll back in, we hurried through the crowded trails to see Miner's Falls. The fast flowing Miner's River drops almost 50 feet over a sandstone outcrop, creating the park's most powerful waterfall. After another quick thunderstorm rolled through, we decided to make a quick trip to Munison Falls and Sand Point. Also fed by Miner's River, this 40-foot waterfall was an awesome side trip on our way back into town. It was just a short hike in from the parking lot. Welcome to Sand Point. That's Grand Island. And it is super windy. Woo! Woo! After a great day of hiking, it was time to grab dinner before retreating to the hotel. And of course, pasties. See what the fuss is about. Oh boy. These pasties remind me of something out of the musical Sweeney Todd, but dang, these things are good. <laughs> Definitely gotta try one. That wraps it up for Picture Rock National Lakeshore. Uh, <laughs> We're being chased out by a thunderstorm again, but uh, had a great time. Hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. If you like this video, hit that like button, leave me a comment, and hit that subscribe button. Stay tuned. Oh boy. <laughs> Stay tuned for tomorrow. Next stop is Kino <laughs> Kiwinaw Peninsula, also known as the Copper Peninsula. Stay tuned. <laughs>